What's going on guys? Welcome to the Escape from Tarkov Alpha. I have gotten permission to post videos on this said alpha and I am seriously looking forward to playing the game. As of right now, it is not obviously the full game and this is just an alpha. It's mostly testing of a part of the game that they call raiding where you equipped your character with weapons, armor, backpacks, ammo, guns, whatever, and then you proceed to go into this raid zone kill everybody or kill as much as you can and try to escape with the loot in which you find in order to sell to a trader to re-equip your character with better weapons in the future. So what I'm going to show you guys right now is kind of how the character in trading works. I haven't messed with it, so I'm going to figure it out with you guys. That way, when the game does release, you kind of have a good idea of how it works. So you go into the character screen. I have like read the tutorial that they sent over to me, uh, the Escape from Tarkov people. So this is currently what I have. I have no headset, no goggles, no helmet, no sling gun, no on the back gun. I do have like a tomahawk and I have nothing in my holster. But this is all I have. I have food, water, all this other things. If I scroll down, I got some bandages, whatever. Uh, you die very fast in this game. It's not exactly incredibly important to bring these bandages along from when I've seen people play on like Twitch streams and YouTube videos. Uh, but I assume in like the full game when you're out adventuring for long periods of time similar to DayZ You're gonna need these things like for sure So this is kind of like your global inventory if you will so you come over here in trading This is where you get all the goodies So this guy sells weapons food ammo grenades magazines this guy buys stuff So once you do escape the raids you can come and sell stuff to this guy in order to buy stuff from him And this person but like sells equipment goggles night vision goggles so if it's nighttime you like need night vision goggles because if you use that flashlight, you're kind of fucked. So I'm going to go to him and now we're going to see what he has for sale on the left side. And this on the right side is my stash. So that being said, we should probably get a weapon that isn't a pistol. We do start with uh, a little bit of money here. We start with 40,000. I think that's just because it's the alpha and they want you to be able to like do stuff. So you can see right here, this gun alone is 70,000, the M4A1 assault rifle. So we're going to go for something a lot cheaper than that. I don't think I really want to start with the pistol. Some of these things are like unknown items. So you buy them and I think it gives it to you. So, huh. This is difficult. So there's sniper rifles, there's shotguns, there's this little bit of everything. I think there is something that I need to redeem to get more money and I could buy more of these things. Because right now I only have pistols. And you can see if I press these buttons on the side, it will single out the things more efficiently. So you actually do have to bring these, this ammo along with you to reload into your magazines in order to shoot the gun. Or you can just build, just bring the fully loaded magazines themselves. Uh, personally, I might just jump in with a pistol. There's a solid chance that I should just try one round with a pistol. Maybe become familiar with the map before I run in with like some crazy ass gun. So in about seven minutes, I believe this means that this is going to reset and there's going to be different items for sale by this this dude. So that's pretty dope. But let's go over to Alexander. Can't even pronounce that at all. And we can see that this guy also sells equipment and other stuff. And there's like loyalty levels. I don't really know how much this really matters, but I assume the more you buy from this dude, the more he'll give you better prices because you're a loyal buyer. So like body armor. There's different knives and random shit. A lot of this stuff is unknown items right now, but you can obviously sort it on the side. So if I'm looking for vests, if I'm looking for goggles, which I really should be, uh, I have nowhere near enough money for that. So that being said, we're going to back on out and we're going to go escape from Tarkov. We're going to choose. All right. We are hopping in. Finally, it's been about like three attempts. I've had bugs, issues everything but now we are joining into a warehouse map and i only have a pistol i brought my chest rig and backpack this time though this is not good we spawned in the sewer sewer is not exactly the safest place in the world long hallways all I have is a pistol. Lots of corners. Yep. All 
I'm scared shitless. I'm probably gonna die in like 15 seconds. Got one. A little scared to loot right now. If we go loot and die, that won't end well. I hear movement. He literally just had a pistol. Actually, I didn't search his pockets. He didn't have anything. Someone's close. We keep looting him. Search. It literally nothing. An eight round magazine. Red Takarov. Makarov, sorry. heard a shotgun, which is bad. I don't know what I'm doing. Nice doggo bark in the background. My actual dog, not in the game. This is my time to open the door. I don't know what I'm doing, dude. Full sprint mode. Oh, that was weird. Not about to go into the open warehouse. Terrible fucking idea. Not making noise if I just tap. Pro tips. I'm trying to be very cautious here. Really should up my sensitivity. I don't hear anybody. I don't see anybody. A lot of shooting coming from that direction. Kind of like a pistol. Okay.
That sounded like a shotgun. Someone's running around close to me. I'm gonna get shot in the back. another person I don't know where sorry if I'm not talking a lot and focusing <laughs> okay That's a dead dude, by the way. There could be teams, by the way. We also gotta be scared of that. People grouping together. Is like fully geared. I'm fucked. I'm so fucked here. Got another one. Shit. I don't know how many are left or how I escape, by the way. I feel like there can't be that many people left. That's a lot of killing. Let's go look around. Oh shit. Uh, hello? Nope, not what I wanted to do. Examine. Thank you. Sega 12 gauge. Search. I'm going to get real cocky here and just think that there's nobody left, by the way. Backpack, nothing. Got a beret. A helmet. Thing's not reloaded. Am I reloaded? Nope. I got a three shot mag in. One shot mag. There we go. I feel like I'm good. I haven't heard any running, any shooting, any anything. I may have literally outlasted the game. And now I think I can just loot up and leave. 
But again, I need to still be cautious. I don't know if AI respawns or what. I really don't know how to like leave. I don't know if it just like gives you just win and then you leave. Do I need to go through a door? Do I need to dip set? I don't know. somebody else. That seemed like AI. He didn't react very fast to what I was doing. my last bullet. How the fuck do I get out of here? I don't know what to do. No. I don't know how to escape. This might this might end in a fail because I don't know what I'm supposed to do after I get everything. I'm injured and bleeding and Shaky as fuck now, too. Just gonna look around for an exit. I don't think there's any humans left. I think, if anything, it's just me versus AI. I can't stand one more fight, though. That looks like a way out. More or less. Random doorway. Maybe? I died. Or I just passed out. Killed in action. Well, still, that was fucking fun. I just gotta look up how to, like, actually escape with the loot. But, like, you guys can kind of get the gist of what that was. Um, that, that was pretty cool. Alright, thanks guys for coming by the first episode of today. Hopefully you enjoyed. Leave a like if you want to see more. Uh, I assume there's gonna be many a comment saying, you gotta go here to escape, you dumb idiot. I just gotta reread the tutorial. I just completely forgot. I've been trying to get a game going for like four hours so uh, i've been up since like 6 a.m <laughs> so i mean yep hopefully you enjoyed the video nonetheless and uh hopefully will not be as much as a fucking noob in the next one